that even after the lecture okay okay the simplest definition of accounting is the language of business it's called accounting the language of business is called accounting we can talk in urdu we can talk in punjabi right we can talk in english that is all language but whenever we are going to talk in business the language which we are going to use that is accounting do you know what is business the word business basically derive from two words that is busy and ness so busy means that you are busy in doing something and business the word has been derived from business that you are busy in doing your own business so definition of business is this that business is an human activity in order to satisfy human need and wants right by producing yes, sir. services through combining the factors of production for the purpose of earning profit that is the definition of business that business is a human activity human involvement has to be there it is raining outside the grass is growing that is not a business because human activity is not there if i am plowing field for myself i am constructing some buildings for the selling purpose that is business because human activity has to be involved in order to satisfy human need and wants by producing goods and services i am a teacher i am producing services basically for you and i am doing business by producing the services and i am satisfying your need which is education actually right but if you will say that i want to study only accounting only from sir haris and i am not going to study from any other teacher my name is haris but actually so what you will that is what because you want sir haris only to teach you accounting so need is the essential need what is need it is essential for the survival of it is essential for survival want is not essential essential for survival needs are almost same for all food shelter clothing want is always different for all needs are always limited and wants are always unlimited needs give you satisfaction wants gives you pleasure i want to become the prime minister of this country this is a want but i want to become a good uh, citizen of pakistan this is a possibility this is just a need it is a possibility because i need to change myself a little it may happen so the business is a human activity in order to satisfy human need and wants by combining the factors of production by producing goods and services for the purpose of earning profit but there can be loss also but the purpose behind the scene is to earn profit our purpose is to earn profit but there can be loss also but motive is to earn profit so can you please tell me now what is this can you define a b and c safa for me i am a student of english and your english is very good that's why can you define a b and c patin g hello there are letters they are letters they are alphabets yeah a for a b for ba c for ka there is no definition of alphabets if i will write alif ba pe there is no definition of alif ba pe that is the alphabets of urdu yeah yes if i am going to ask you that if you multiply plus with plus what you will get plus right yeah and if you multiply minus with minus what you will get plus am i right yes yeah, sir plus plus is plus minus minus is plus my question is from fatin if plus plus is plus i believe that minus minus should be minus and i have a logical question can you answer me safa you are a very good student of maths you can't answer me because these are the rules of mathematics which you are following since your childhood it has never come into your mind even 
or ne never ask this question to your teacher. Otherwise, he will kick you out of the class. That what question you are asking? Plus plus is plus, minus minus is plus. This is the rule of maths. Same is the case with accounting. Accounting has its certain alphabets, and those alphabets are called debit record and credit record. Those alphabets are called debit record and credit record. These are the alphabets of the language of accounting which is used in business. मैं ये लिख रहा हूँ machinery purchase for cash. This is English. अगर मैं लिखता हूँ उर्दू के अंदर, I'm going to write in Urdu. Machinery khiridi. That is Urdu. In which language I am going to write this transaction? In business, the language is called accounting, and the alphabets of accounting language is de debit and credit. And debit stand for debit record, and credit stand for credit record. These are the abbreviation of debit and credit. So machinery purchase for cash is English. Machinery khiridi kar bolunga to wo Urdu hogi. The language in which I am going to record this transaction, that language is accounting, and the alphabets of this language is debit and credit. So accounting is basically based upon dual aspect concept, and dual aspect concept says that every transaction has two aspects: one on the debit side and one on the credit side. One on the debit side. and one on the credit side so accounting is based upon dual aspect concept which says that every transaction has two aspects one on the debit side and one on the credit side it means that every action has reaction every action has reaction which is equal in amount but opposite in direction every action has reaction which is equal in amount but opposite in direction any monetary dealing what is transaction any monetary dealing between two people is called transaction any monetary dealing between two people is called transaction safa i have great affection for you affection for you uh patin can i buy laziness from you can i buy or can i can i buy attitude from you you have a great attitude how much are you willing to sell there is no price for that affection love hatred laziness dedication my honesty my sincerity there is no price for that accounting is silent on that accounting only records those transactions which has monetary value so any monetary dealing between two people is called transaction and every transaction has two aspects one is on the debit side and one on the credit side for example if i will take an example machinery purchase for cash So what do you think when you purchase machinery what is going out of the business cash will go out of the business and machinery is going to come into the business so machinery with the same amount is coming into the business and cash with the same amount is going out of the business which is opposite to each other machinery aa rahi hai cash ja raha hai equal in amount but opposite in direction the whole accounting is basically based upon this dual aspect concept that every transaction has two sides two aspects one on the debit side and one on the credit side and transaction kya hoti hai any monetary dealing between two people is called is called transaction it has to be monetary dealing because any the dealing without the involvement of money will not be recorded in accounting record accounting deals only with financial transactions accounting deals only with financial transactions and the main on which the whole accounting is basically based upon is accounting equation an accounting equation says that assets is equal to liabilities plus capital assets is equal to liabilities plus capital this is the accounting equation on which the whole accounting is based upon the left hand side is called debit side the right hand side is called credit side how this equation is equal because sources are always equal to sources right 
आपको मैं एक्सप्लेन करता हूँ अकाउंटिंग क्वेश्चन को इसके अलावा जो मैंने समझाया है उसमें कुछ मसला है तो मुझे बताएं प्लीज सफा एनी प्रॉब्लम टिल हेयर नो सर जी फातिन एनी क्वेश्चन यू वॉन्ट टू आस्क प्लीज आई एम रेडी टू हियर योर वॉइस प्लीज नो सर ओके सो अकाउंटिंग इक्वेशन बेसिकली सेस That assets equal to liabilities plus capital, which say that resources are always equal to sources. I have gone for a wrong spelling. Uh, you may overlook that because you know I am typing, so it may happen like that. Resources, what we need in yes, business, and source from where the money is going to come. I decided with Fatin and uh, Safa that we are going to open a beauty parlor in Lahore, and we both, we all are going to invest in that. We need resource for that. we need building we need machinery equipment land furniture how i am going to get these resources i need some source paisa kahan se aayega hum lagayenge paisa which is called capital yani amount invested by the owner of the business is called capital aur agar wo paisa khatam ho jayega to mujhe fatin aur safa aapke father se paise udhar lene padenge they are liabilities liabilities means which are liable which you are liable to pay anything which is payable is a liability anything which is payable is a liability capital is the amount invested by the owner of the business that is called capital by which we are going to purchase the resources building machinery motor vehicle land furniture equipment lekin agar hamara capital khatam ho jayega to kya karenge bhai bank se loan le lenge jo bank se hum loan lenge that needs to be repaid back to the bank and they are called liabilities because anything which is payable is a liability so this accounting question will always be equal because it says that assets is equal to liabilities plus capital and resources of business are called assets and how we are going to get these resources we need some source jo paisa kahan se aayega either from the owner's own pocket which is called capital or we have to take loan from third party which is called a liability ji yahan tak koi masla hai to bataye any problem no sir no sir clear hai so time is only 1 minute left inshallah tala hopefully uh, uh, i want to go for another class tomorrow if you can if you are free we can go for tomorrow class yes sir i am